Welcome back. Now, the NHL just passed through, and although Golden Knight Mark Stone did not win an award, we all won by having Keenan Thompson from Saturday Night Live as the host. Now, we all were honored by having Willie O'Ree as well, the first black player to play in the NHL in-house and on the red carpet, as was actor John Hamm, who basically won the Stanley Cup alongside his brethren, the St. Louis Blues. And, of course, Commissioner Gary Bettman, who had to talk about the role changes that were coming up. Well, I talked to all of them on the red carpet, and here are some of those highlights right here on Sports Night. Jackie, bro. You know what That's what you got there. Like, first thing I'm wondering about, Keenan Thompson, you go from the Mighty Ducks to host the NHL Awards. How did this even come about? Um, I mean, there's been a lot of nostalgia around the Ducks lately, I guess, you know, 20 year anniversary and stuff like that. And then um, I did like an NHL uh, video just for the NHL, like playing a couple of stuff. And then I got to meet the commissioners, and they invited me out to the Caps like finals last year. And it's just been an ongoing relationship since. Okay. So you, you're not going to be like Chance the Rapper? You got this hockey thing going on in the background? I mean, there? I'm halfway there. You know what I mean? I know a little bit more because I've been paying attention to the hosting duties. But um, yeah, man, we got to go do that hockey. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta go do that hockey. Now I'm wondering, are we going to see maybe a little Charles Barkley? The Steve Harvey in, in the promo that you did kills me with the mustache. Yeah, it's all about the mustache. <laughs> yeah, I think you will. You know, I mean, I'm, we're trying to have a good time tonight. We're coming here and just keep the show moving along. What is it like for you coming to an event like this, being obviously the, the Jackie Robinson, the first black man to play in the NHL Awards? What does this mean to you? Well, it's uh, I'm very excited and it's very meaningful. Uh, I was here last year and. Uh, I just happened to be brought up at the, at, the, at the time the Bruins needed somebody for a little spark. And, uh, you know, when I broke the color barrier in 1958 and became the first black player in the, in the NHL, it, it was a nice feeling. How about the timing for that? I mean, you, you guys win the Stanley Cup. I'm, I'm just going to go ahead and put you guys in there, you in there with him. And then you come in here to kind of host the awards or co-host the awards, be a special presenter with uh, Alex Trebek. Yeah, that's really great. You know, I mean, it, I'm glad it worked out. I was... Uh, I was in London for a lot of the games and watching hockey at one o'clock in the morning in a hotel is not the best way to do it, but a win's a win. And uh, I was glad it was able to work out with my schedule that I could be here to celebrate the team as well. You tired of Gloria yet? No, I don't think I'm going to get tired of that song. I'll be honest with you. It means a lot. You guys talked about as far as the rule changes and whatnot. How did that go? Well, we're focused on the fact that we always are self-aware. We always look for ways to be better. Uh, listen, this is a game that requires a important human element, whether it's the coaches, the players, or the officials. And mistakes happen, and teams who ultimately win have to overcome adversity on occasion. Whether it's a bad call, an injury, a bad bounce, it happens. That's the game of hockey. It's part of what makes it so unpredictable.